morning. <laughs> We're back again. Apparently you guys like watching me. I don't know. Right, so I need to sort this out this morning. It's just not happy at the moment. And then we're going to Warwick Castle to the Zog uh, outdoor thing. So I thought I'd show you my makeup. It, I keep it really, really, really simple. I don't wear loads day to day. But it depends on what my skin is doing that day, how little I can get away with. But today I'm going to, so going to use just boy brow, blush, and push up lashes by Charlotte Tilbury. Maybe a bit of illuminizer and a tiny bit of concealer and that is all I'm going to do today so I just look normally go around my eyes so just brighten them up a little bit this is the makeup forever one I've had this for ages well must have expired by now but um because makeup forever isn't in the UK anymore so I just put a little bit there a little bit because I always have a red section at the corner of my eye and then I don't bother about spot concealing to be honest because I only do that sort of for like occasions. I tend to use a brush, yeah. I'm very, very simple day to day. I think it's just, I don't know, fitness instructor life. I've just never really been. I love makeup, it's really weird. I love makeup, but I don't need to wear it every day. But as I was about to say, as a fitness instructor, you just used to be seen with like, I don't work out with makeup on. Uh, with no makeup on, sweating, and you just don't really care. I'll put the excesses on that little bit, and that's on the eczema cream. It's making me break out a little bit. My skin does look really red today. Hmm, I gave it a good scrub. Right, so this stuff is amazing. This is the Iconic London Sheer Blush, and you can put loads on, and it doesn't really, it doesn't make you too, too pink. But I love this pink colour. I think they've just brought out a, a bronzer. So I just pat it on. My cheeks like so. And then I'll probably use my hands most of the time but I do use a brush. I just blend it in. You can just see it's really really sheer. But if I blush it just picks up your face so much. Rub a little bit on my nose. I try not to put it on the rounds of my cheeks especially if I'm red like this then whatever's left on my fingers I just press onto my eyelids and it just adds like a little bit of colour and like ties everything in yeah my skin looks rough today I probably should put foundation on but it is what it is this is the radiance illuminating primer so it's a really really subtle shade from flat smash box it's not too good to me oh phone's going and I'll just pat that on there uh, and it's a real really subtle sheen i do the same again whatever's left i just pop onto my eyelids and my nose so yes yeah, so i'm very much about enhancing what you've got and if it's not good that day you just go deal with it <laughs> and boy brow i love these sort of brow gels because i do have very full eyebrows i have grown them out and i'm liking it i don't think i'll get my eyebrows in again Brushing through, just the sticking up, and then I'll add some, some mascara and I'm good to go. If you've not seen my video on this mascara, have a look at it because uh, it is a really good mascara. So, touching on my jewellery collection, my little pineapple cake. How cute is that little pineapple? And then I got the bigger hoops as well. I think it's in the right mess, but I just thought I'd touch it on that. Hello. Well, you look cool. Why did Daddy put you in though? Shorts and big socks. Is it funny? Oh, I better go see what your brother's doing. What are you doing? I'm pretending. Why? <laughs> We've got to get ready to go to the castle. I am. I'm My granola. I've got raspberries with mine. What have you got? Um, strawberries. I think it's raspberries as well, and granola, and yogurt. Mine's the same, but I've got almond milk instead of yogurt, and a bit of banana. Again, like seriously, so much stuff. We've got stuff for bottles, 
orange bag because we're um, putting in pants basically so we're expecting a few accidents. Taylor's bag with a picnic in it as well. Just so much stuff. So we just got here and as we pulled in orange threw up everywhere. It's like <laughs> so much sick. So we've literally had to get him fully dressed in the car park. So we're running a bit late so we've only got a little bit of time here before we've got to get to nursery. But the day is beautiful, so it should be lovely. So next to the orange one. Yeah, has it got a dragon in it? <gasps> Look at this big dragon. You ready? Good boy. Big jump! Do you want daddy to help? <gasps> wow! Just make filming for the BBC. Not sure what it is. Sure? <laughs> What's that supposed to be? Gingerbread man? Is it a gingerbread ice cream? Toddler running towards a fountain. <laughs> oh goodness. Let's come in to check on the studio. See what state we're in. We're good. I'm now going to. I might look in some furniture shops because I want to get into kind of like upcycling some furniture. Maybe I might pop to Elm. Hello, little man. So glad he loves this because I made this. So it makes me very happy when he like loves it. And he loves like all the things in the nursery. And I love that he loves it so much. So this morning I'm doing a flexibility class. Um, showing you off mum, my mum and Tom right now. So I'm trying to be positive. But we've got a long way to go. So yeah, hour and a half splits training and then Tom's currently getting the paddling pool like blown up, it's 9am um, <laughs> Orin already wants to go in it, he's been asking to go in the paddling pool so, <laughs> Boxing day <laughs> Oh mummy, put your camera up Up? Oh. Oh. No Down Oh, this bit. Yeah. What are you doing? Um, I'm just making it out and flip over. Okay, you're going to be careful. Oh. Okay. Time for some morning exercise. Yeah, that's it. You move those legs. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> Oh dear. So had your vaccinations yesterday, didn't you? You were very, very distraught last night. But he's in a fab mood this morning. Aren't you? Great boy. So it's been a really mad day. Orin was crazy this morning. Um, and then I've just gone and got another hole put in my ear. So I've got these ones and this one's been repair so I've just put a bigger bar in that because it always closes off and I have to repair my ears all the time and really getting into wearing earrings at the moment. You can hear Ty and get to say to you all and um yeah we've just I basically popped to the studio I just had to get a keys cut for one of my new instructors didn't really want to film that because it's pretty boring and for the rest of the day, I don't know what we're going to do. I think we're actually just going to chill out. I've done some flexibility already and yeah, Tom's back at work. So it's a little bit like, oh, what do we do now? Apparently, we shelter sea life creatures on baby mobile mobiles. <laughs>
<laughs> doing our exercises. <laughs> what are you doing? Is that you? <laughs> so we ended up going for a little trip to TK Maxx. I had to go to the supermarket and have a look at some home stuff there uh, to do some bits up. And yeah, I'm going to wrap that vlog up here. So that's what we've been up to this week. And I will be doing some normal like videos in the next couple of days as well as I'll keep doing these like vlogs over a few days and see how they go. But thank you very much for watching. <laughs> He's having a whale of a time over here. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Bye.